looking good. You did good, Rosa. They look happy. But they were easy. The next one? I'm not so sure. All right, everybody, right this way. And make sure you don't step in any of the flower beds, okay? My friend Manny here, who I'm pretty sure lives here, because let's be honest, I practically live here myself too. He knows about every single flower at the courthouse and will personally hunt you down if you step on even one leaf. Right, Manny? <laughs> single file line up the stairs, follow me in. Let's get started. He's good, no? Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. That's okay. You're an artist. Trying to be. I just have this project, historical landmark, that reminds us of beauty and love, so figured this would work, right? This is a beautiful place. But as for love, well, your true love just went up those stairs with his tour group. And if you want to get his attention, you're gonna have to do something more than just hide behind the sketchy books. A man wants to know that you notice him. And then when you notice him, he notices you noticing him. And then he notices you. You know? Where is this coming from? Uh, you don't want to know. I really think you have me confused with someone else. I don't even know his name. Actually, you do. You wrote it right there. It's Steven. Him. Am I that obvious? To me, yes. But my wife, Rosa, she says that I see things other people don't see. But I could be wrong. But if I'm right, and you really like him, you're gonna have to do something to get his attention. And if for this one, it won't be easy. Sounds like you know him. Oh, him, his father, his grandfather, all lawyers here. He wants to be a lawyer too, but he's so busy with his nose in the books, that he doesn't stop to smell the beautiful flowers. I know what you mean, but how do I do that? I know he likes the color red. I know that he eats lunch by the staircase every day. I know that he studies in the courtroom four every night. I know because I give him the keys when he locks up, but don't tell anybody. I'm not sure what to do with all that, though. You'll think of something. The building you're looking at now is actually not the original courthouse. The original Greek Revival Courthouse was located where you're standing right now. The Sunken Gardens, which is Santa Barbara's most popular place to relax, or have a lunch picnic, or draw. Right, draw. Hey, Manny. Hey, mijo. Another day, all work and no play. Hey, keeps me out of this courthouse and into the courtrooms when I pass the bar. All right, all right. Listen, this time, remembers to turn out the lights, okay? <laughs> you sound like Rosa. <laughs> After 31 years, you'll start to sound like your wife, too, if you ever slow down to catch one. Hey, who says I haven't caught one yet? My spare keys, that book bag. So we have ghosts making phone calls now? Esperate. Same time, every night, all week. The phone company's gonna come out here next week to look at it, but I think it's got like a shorts in the circuit. Hey, I like the ghost story better. Well, listen, if it rings again, pick it up, put it down. Otherwise, it's going to ring all night. Got it. All right, you got it. Do we have a date yet? We have a, hey, you're pretty good at that. And uh, does someone pay you to draw this stuff? Does that count? Uh, you're asking the wrong guy. With my wife Rosa and me, it was love at first sight. Next thing you know, we're right over there with the Justice of the Peace, the Mariachi Band. I take it you're still together? 31 years and counting. I will
will take 31 minutes. He is just so focused on everything but meeting me. Uh, you're right. Maybe you should do what my wife Rosa did. She used to bribe me with food. <laughs> you know those quesadillas from Super Rica? Those will change your life. Maybe the way to this man's heart through a stomach. That sounds anatomically incorrect, but worth a try. So, dinner, eight o'clock. Promise? Cross my heart. God, you're here. I left my sketchbook inside. It's on a bench, and I really need it for tomorrow. Did you take out the trash yet? I thought that you said you left it on a bench. It's a long story, but I really, really need my notebook. I have an idea. I'll open up. You go in there and run around and find it, and then you come back out. But don't take too long. Thank you so much. I know exactly where I left it. No! Wait, 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 wait! wait. Hello? Is anyone out there? Manny? It's no use. Considering the ironwork on these doors is a good 5k, there's no use breaking the lock. We're stuck. Well, this is a first. <laughs> you seem pretty chipper considering we're stuck. Not for long. Manny's outside and he knows I'm in here, so he'll come get me. Not if he thinks you're gonna run into me and I'll let you out. Well, what about your girlfriend? Won't she be worried? If I had a girlfriend. Spiral staircase, big hug. Oh, Nicole? That's my cousin. I'm gonna meet her new boyfriend tomorrow. Oh, I just assumed, you know, big hug. <laughs> yeah, she does that. What about you? Do you have a boyfriend? Does my cat count? <laughs> well, that depends. Does he sleep with you? Don't answer that. So, what are you doing here? I accidentally left my sketchbook. You're the girl in the red dress. You noticed? Yeah, I saw you underneath the staircase and in the sunken gardens and... You saw me there? Yeah. Don't take this the wrong way, but you smelled like a quesadilla and I was like starving all day after that. I love quesadillas. What about you? What do you love? Name something quick off the top of your head. I love drawing, but not just anything. It has to be something that I really, really like, you know? Wow, I have an idea. How about if we get out of here, you draw a picture of us going out to dinner? <laughs> really? Yeah, we can get some quesadillas. I'd love to. Fanny. Hey, Manny. Hey, what do we have here? You're right, all work, no play. Highly overrated. But, duty calls. Lunch? Uh, I'm, uh, I'm busy. <laughs> of course. Oh yeah, you should go, you can go. These are for you, and Rosa. Which is grass, yes. Ah, yeah. ah, we did good, Rosa. You're a match made in heaven. <laughs>